Welcome to this CAD line video identifying how to better integrate your CAD and GIS workflows. Part 1 will explore a number of open source geospatial applications that will help us centralise our asset information and reduce the cost of processing your OS master map holding. I'm a geographer in a CAD world and often find the interface of CAD software overwhelming with many highly advanced tools. In addition, I'm used to seeing OS base mapping stylized instead of shown as simple line work. The next major difference this geography sees is that asset information is often captured and held within the DWG itself, making integration with other software impossible. So the first thing I do for my clients is to use a map export command and extract spatial data in GIS format. We can then use the open source GIS application, such as QGIS, to load those assets into a spatial database, in this case PostGIS, which means that data is then centrally stored and accessible by all. Now our spatial data sets are in a PostGIS database, we can use other open source software such as GeoServer to publish our assets as lightweight web mapping feeds. These can be consumed and interrogated by GIS, CAD and web applications. In fact, by uploading your OS master map data into a PostGIS database, you can also use GeoServer to style your base mapping on the fly, making it accessible to all of your users. In part two of this four part playlist, we'll explore how using PostGIS and GeoServer, we're now in a position to better integrate our GIS and CAD teams.